Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to walk you through this walking door transition. If you're new to this channel, I make these kinds of tutorials every Thursday. So if you found them to be helpful, just subscribe and you will get notifications when there is another video out. Okay, let's jump into the tutorial. Okay, we'll go through the transition real quick where it looks like you're walking through the door. So you go into your project. And then you'll need to have a clip where you'll walk against the door. And then when you're at the door, you'll walk up closely to the door, up to the window with a camera like that. And the transition is going to be to this place here. So we're going to speed ramp this clip. So what you'll do when you'll speed ramp is you'll press shift, shift B, shift B. Then you'll add a marker here and then you'll go to where you would like the speed ramp to end there in this case we'll cut this clip so you'll press b cut the clip and then you'll have a speed ramp bar here which you can pull front and back which will speed ramp the clip here you can maybe yeah, you can modify this as you like and then we'll cut this clip out where we are on the other side of the door so we press b press the clip press a mark the clip press backspace to remove it then what you want to do is you just want to add a uh, dissolve transition here where you'll just mark the edge of this clip then you'll press command t then you'll have A dissolved transition there I want this to be a little bit faster yeah you can modify this as you wish maybe I'll cut mark this I'll press command X to cut it out and I make this a few frames shorter Let's see how that looks. Yeah. I think that looks pretty cool. You can also maybe speed ramp this clip a bit. So you go here, you press shift B again, and you'll drag this in a little bit. Let's see how that feels. You can draw in that bar there to Make the acceleration down to normal speed quicker or down, down speedment. I don't know what the name is. You can double click on this bar here in order to manually put in the speed right in 200%. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay, so that's it for this video. Like it if you found it to be helpful. Subscribe if you want more tutorials like this. Peace out. Good luck with your projects.